Okay, in this video we want to talk about one of the most useful applications of the fluorescence phenomenon in the field of biology which is called the immunofluorescence. The technique is simple, you know, we use the antibodies, these antibodies have a specific affinity towards the antigens on some compounds, okay? So, if we accommodate these antibodies with the fluorescence uh, molecules, we can treat our proteins with the antibodies, you know, with these monoclonal antibodies, and then appreciate the different colors uh, under the microscope. You know, we can just uh, introduce some antibodies which are specific towards different parts of the cells. Let's have a better look at it. As you see the cell structure here, different, different parts of the cells, they have expressed different antigens on their surface. For example, in this case, the mitochondrion, uh, if we introduce the antibodies uh, with, uh, which are, for example, you know, uh, accommodated with the green fluorescence molecules, and some other antibodies uh, which are uh, selective which can selectively bind to the nucleus with orange molecules fluorescence molecules and some others uh, for example to this Golgi uh, with uh, blue fluorescence uh, molecules and we treat our cells by all of these antibodies and we look at the cell structure under the microscope we can differentiate between the different parts of the cells based on the colors that we 